Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable all the remaining hidden features inside Windows 11 build 23493, the latest build from the dev channel. All these features were discovered by Phantom Ocean 3 on Twitter, so make sure to follow him from the pinned comment below. These hidden features are related to the start menu and file explorer. We have a few improvements that we can enable and in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated. So that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin by the video first of all as always we're gonna have to download and set up vive tool so just go ahead and download it from the link in the article below in the video's description and make sure you download the latest version that's it open it up using file explorer click on extract all click on browse and then go into this pc local disk c windows and then scroll down to system 32 select it click on select folder extract i'm gonna have to replace the files in my case and then click on continue and that is how easily you can set up vive tool on your computer now we're going to have to open up the CMD using the search box and then click on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. And the CMD, you're going to have to copy and paste in a few commands. The first command is this one, which is basically the command that will enable the new snap assist related to the snap layouts in the file explorer. You have two different variants. For this video, I'm going to show you the second variant, but of course you can change from here slash variant. You can use one or two, and that will only change where the app recommendations appear in the right or the left side. Of course, I'm going to demonstrate that to you to see how that looks and what it means. The second command is this one, which includes a few more IDs, and this will enable some new file explorer improvements related to nearby sharing. And here, the last command, we have some improvements related to the start menu that will now label certain system apps as system. As I've said, all these IDs and commands were discovered by Phantom Ocean 3 on Twitter, so don't forget to follow him. Also, these commands will be in the article below in the video's description. After you run all these commands, make sure to exit out from the CMD and restart your computer for the changes to take effect. After the restart, let's now see what has changed. So first of all, the smart snap assist suggestions that are in the file explorer go into the snap layouts. And as you can see, I am suggested to snap using OBS, the software that I use to record. And of course, if you have other apps opened, they will appear here. And as I've said, you can change that variant one or two to change the position where you want those smart snap assist suggestions to appear. Now, if we are selecting a file and then clicking on the share button, you'll notice some interesting improvements. First of all, we now have a a search box where we can search for people or email. We have a larger UI and also we have updates to the top part and hiding the nearby sharing section. So I think this is looking pretty nice in my opinion. So uh, I think it's worth doing a test with this if you are using the sharing feature. And the start menu, as I've said, certain apps such as File Explorer, Get Help, Get Started, Microsoft Store are labeled as system apps. And Microsoft will continue to do these labelings and I think they are pretty useful. So these are all the remaining hidden features that you can enable in Windows 11 the latest build from the dev channel. We could see a new build in a few hours or tomorrow. So when that releases, of course, I'm going to make a new video and we'll go from there. Don't forget that the downloading for Vive tool is in the article below in the video's description and also the commands that I've used in this video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Manny from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.